Hi, I'm Stanley Stewart, and in this video, we're going to learn how to deal with fear and anxiety. Now, there's many, many techniques for dealing with fear and anxiety, but I'm just going to give you one powerful technique that works instantly and you could use anywhere. And then after I give you the technique, I'm going to explain why it works. And you'll see why I save the explanation for the end once we get done with the video. So what I want you to do is I want you to think of the most fearful, most anxiety provoking situation that you could think of. So for example, you may be thinking about telling a cute man or woman that you like them, or you may be thinking about telling someone you're suicidal. Whatever it is, really dive deep into it and feel all that fear and anxiety. Great. Now imagine yourself in the future looking back on the event. So for example, if you think about telling someone you're suicidal tomorrow, instead imagine it two days from now and you're remembering what it was like to tell someone you're suicidal. Okay, you should feel all that fear and anxiety drop away. The reason for this is that your mind triggers fear and anxiety in order to prevent you from doing something. So it doesn't want you to tell people you're suicidal, so you feel fear and anxiety so you don't do it. Or it doesn't want you to jump off a cliff, so when you get close to a cliff, it makes you feel fear and anxiety so you back away. But your mind doesn't have a reason to prevent you from doing stuff that are in the past. So if your mind thinks you already told someone you're suicidal, it can't prevent that and so it doesn't give you any fear and anxiety. I really like this technique and I think it's a great application of the way your mind and emotion works. And if you want to learn more techniques like this, you can always go to stopsuicidalsuffering.com forward slash blog or just click the link at the bottom of this video.